Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to Spider-Man on the PS4. So I have a lot of tokens I haven't been using, which is foolish. So let's change that right now and upgrade our web shooters. One backpack token, five crime tokens. I have 51. There's no excuse. What are we waiting for? And there we go. Maxed out standard web shooters. What else can we do here? Impact web. Five crime tokens again, but eh, no big deal. All right. That's probably all we could do for now. But I am in the lab because I discovered there's more puzzles to solve for research tokens and We're trying experience. To improve the prosthetics hardware. I should review what Doc's been developing and double check his work. So I'm going to do these real quick. I'm going to cut it out. I didn't realize these existed, but these are like the voltage thingies. So I'll just do all these real quick and see if we gain another level. Okay, what did that do? Ah, almost. We're close. Okay, so now I want to do the side mission. Actually, hang on, before that, I'm going to make a manual save because you never know what's going to happen when you start recording. But now that we have those tests out of the way, you know it now. We're saving, and now we're going to do the tombstone side mission. While I'm here, I should examine the transmitter MJ found. Jeez, started in the lab, sat through load screens just to be back in the lab. It's all good, though. I always cut them out. <laughs> Same table and everything. If I can reverse engineer this, it should track Tombstone's shipments. Oh, jeez, I just did a handful of these. Well, that's good. Okay, with a maze, you always start at the end because there's only one true path, right? Wrong! No, maybe it's right. All right, voltage, minus one. Let's just go with that for now. So, well, do minus two, actually. Because, you know, you never know. It might be one of those crafty things. So, all right, we loop around. We need a tunnel. There we go. Now we have only the essential pieces to figure out from the start. Probably going to have to loop around and use both of these voltage thingies. So we'll make the path up. Curve it over and see what our options are for the green. Crap, wrong piece. There we go. Plus three and plus one. We'll do the plus three. We need a target voltage of five. How's this going to work? This is going to have to be a minus one. So it went with my initial instinct. There we go. Because then we're going to have six, minus one, five, boom. Okay, so another three. Yeah, it's overloaded. Why? Oh, because it's not connected yet. Yeah, when it connects, it'll do the minus one. Sweet. It's actually easier than some of the ones I just solved. That should do it. Time for a test run. I don't mind those things, actually. It's a nice little... Especially while a video is rendering or whatever. Okay, just gotta follow the signal. Should lead to whatever it is Tombstone's moving. All right, tracking the signal, let's do it. Tombstone, this guy's the mother of all headaches. Impermeable skin plus zero morals equals bad time. So running a chop shop's the worst thing he's up to. I don't really know too much about Lonnie Lincoln, Tombstone. You know how it is when you're a kid. At least kids of our time, if you're of my general age range. Late 80s, mid 80s, late 90s, mid 90s, whatever. Early 90s, yeah. We weren't really the comic book generation. We had video games and TV. So I never really was super invested in the comics. I just liked the cartoons and the video games. Wait a minute here. And yeah, I never played a Spider-Man video game that had Tombstone in it. Ah, losing it. What am I losing? I didn't know I found anything. Oh wait, there's a radar dot. Truck? Okay. Get off the wall, Spidey. Is it weird to call him Spidey? Truck. 
Out for a Sunday drive. Okay, now we can. Oh, get out of here, chum. What am I supposed to do? Wait, there was an X thing. Whatever. We just beat up all the guys that come running, I guess. So I don't really know what I'm supposed to do with the truck just yet. There's no button prompt. Anybody else ever play the NES Spider-Man? Jeez. One uppercut exploded a whole motor motorcycle. Oh, yeah, I remember liking that NES game as a kid. I think I used to always get to Vulture and then die. But then, when I got older... Whew. Biker gang down. Let's see what's in that truck. What the heck? The door reappeared. Chemical containers. But they're scrubbed clean. Looks like they came from the Alchemax plant in Harlem, but what was in them? And that sound means the end of our lightning round. Should head to Alchemax when I get a chance and find out what was in those barrels. Tombstone's up to something. Probably illegal. Definitely dangerous. Sweet. That's it? It doesn't sound like it was it. But there's our level. 25. But yeah, the NES Spider-Man, in later years, I read reviews and, like, nobody likes it. Which is understandable, because it is really difficult. And that's the end of that story. Moving on. We have a new suit. Oh no, just mods. Huh. Electrify enemies on touch and... Gadget refills while taking damage. That could be... Too bad you can't have four, right? Challenge tokens. Ah, we gotta. That's why I'm doing this, to be honest, because. It seems weird that the main story would introduce this side mission. Like maybe this is how you unlock a gadget or something. Why did it switch? So yeah, we gotta go to Tombstone's place now, or the, the plant. I guess. I don't know if they're one and the same. Oh, wow, way over here? Suppose we could fast travel to the police department. You see something, say something, right? The problem with you is you always see something. Are they brawling? What are they doing? Whatever. I just had a crazy thing happen to me. I heard this huge hissing noise for like a minute straight. It was so loud. I thought my water heater was leaking or something. So I went and got somebody, and I think my air conditioner is just broken again, and there was a Freon leak. But I was told it's safe. There's the Alchemax plant. What is he building in there? Isn't that a Tom Waits lyric? Huh, good timing. Tombstone's men are loading fresh supplies. What for, though? Is he getting back into drugs? They're heavily armed. This might be easier if I stay quiet. Where are all the security guards? All right, kind of more of the same stuff here, but it's okay. Again, my hope is that this either unlocks challenge tokens or something else. Because why would they make Mary Jane make a big deal about it and introduce it? All these puzzles are safe to be around. Safe for them being around the boss if we screw up. Shake a freaking leg. What was that sound? It is still fun though, just the initial setup. Finding the first safeguard. Yeah, because that one gadget, the concussive blast, that seems like it would be really helpful. With a big mob of guys, you know, just blow them all over and then focus on who you want to take down first. That work? Nah, too far the away. Was that? Oh no, it did work. Sweet. Uh. <laughs> I, 
wish I was faster at this stealth stuff, because I know it's possible to just know where to go immediately. Cause a distraction and get them. I feel like I'm here like 30 minutes longer than I need to be. Ah, well. First time, dude. There is a little bit too much of that. With the whole broadcast yourself online thing. That pressure of like, you gotta be perfect or otherwise just don't even bother. Which is not true, of course, but it still is there, kind of. But then that gets into the whole argument of let's plays or gameplay without commentary. But I was always told, based on rules written out on YouTube and crap, that if you're gonna capture video game content just by itself and do nothing more, you can't, like, monetize that content or anything. So I don't know how people do that. People who run those long play channels and do monetize them. That time. And I know it exists, like, Gamer's Little Playground. I like that channel because they cut all the loads and they... the weird stuff and kind of make it more like a movie, you know? Which this game, that's exactly what it needs. If there ever was a game, this and like the Arkham Asylum Batman games. Probably the best way to put these videos online for people is to do that. No commentary, cut out the fluff, and just do the important cutscenes and kind of make it like a game movie, you know? Guess I could use a trip mine. I like this trip line thing. Oh, what? Come on, please. <laughs> Pigeon thing. Never gonna forget it. Dawdling like an idiot, as we do. It's all good. But yeah, when my uh, air conditioner exploded or whatever happened. Oh, that guy's already dead. I saw him. I thought he was a, a sniper or something. Yeah, the no sleep. I was like, just not even really coherent. And then that huge noise happened. I was really startled. Like I quick threw some shoes on and ran outside and ran to the office to see what was up. Sleep it off. Come on, Spider-Man. This is the last dude, I think. Slowest stealth mission ever. Tombstones men are down. Now to find out what's in these barrels. All right, well, on with it then. Diox three. Isn't this the chemical tombstone was exposed to as a kid? What's he doing with it now? Jeez. The heck? I'm guessing that stuff's not for asthma. Oh my gosh, it turned into styrofoam that doesn't break. Ow. Now oh, hang on a minute. Well, do you need some more drugs? Someone's gotta teach these guys about the dangers of peer pressure. Ow. How does a whole mo motorcycle hit you in the head, explode, and then you're still standing from it? You Elton John. Whatever. That's the only strategy I can think of. Just throw crap at the weird zombie guys. Recording gameplay without commentary is like 
10 times easier and like 30 times faster. As far as editing and rendering and uploading. This is basically hit record, stop. If there's anything you gotta cut out, just do it real quick and then boom, you're done. Commentary just adds so much crap to it. I guess you can't throw a motorcycle and dodge at the same time. That makes sense. That's pretty sweet. Every time. I mean, it's not new. This guy's hiding back there. We got stuff to do, pal. The mission needs to be over. Bad feeling those drug inhalers and the Diox 3 are related. Should analyze an inhaler to find out what's going on here. All right, what's in you? Ah, oh, jeez, more of this stuff. It's all right, though. So which one do we start with? So once you figure out one, it narrows down everything, so that's... There we go. It's three pieces of race. Hopefully it's right. Put two there, and then we need one. And then this, and the singular. No, wait. That's not going to work. Mm, I thought I had it. Okay. I don't know what I did. I just started pushing pieces randomly. Whatever. I'm still not Diox with it. Three plus designer amphetamines. Pretty clever recipe for temporary invulnerability. I'm impressed. And worried. This stuff hits the street and there will be a huge market for it. With Tombstone as the sole supplier. I think I can synthesize a counter drug. I wonder if there are any lab supplies in that truck. Time for some artisanal science. Sweet, I don't have to do anything. There, single dose of the counter drug. Just need to test it out. Alright, to Tombstone himself, I'm guessing. Maybe I should pay Tombstone a visit at his chop shop. Yeah, I was going to say, maybe I I am huffing Freon and slowly losing it, hence the brain not working. Or, we were born stupid and stayed that way. One of the two. Where the heck is this dude? Oh, he's up here. Gotcha. Not too far away. But yeah, I can't afford to go stay at somebody else's place or anything. If there is something to worry about here, I was told not. I think it just broke. My air conditioning here has broke so many times. But luckily, it's no longer summer, even though it's still trying to be. It was like 75 degrees Fahrenheit, obviously, the other day, yesterday. I think that's why it broke. I turned the air conditioning on in mid-November here. And then, once it started to cool down, I switched it off, and then five minutes after that is when the noise happened, and then I smelled that smelly smell, you know. But it was very low to the ground, and then I read that's what Freon does. It stays low compared to all the other Time air. Time to shut Tombstone down. Which is why it's dangerous for kids and pets. Especially everybody, all those low, crawling people, you know. The angry drug lord drank alone. There's a poem in there somewhere. You know 
better than me. Never was the literary type. Yeah, right. How'd you even manage to connect with Martin Lee? I'm top of my game. I don't go knocking. People find me. Figure all the brute strategies are the way to go here. Team up, we can do some real damage. Ah, oh, so glad. But the exploitation of suffering thing gives me pause. I need to tire him out before I try the counter drug. Could punch Tombstone for days and he wouldn't feel it. Wonder if the counter drug would work on him. Boys, get in here. You remember the last time we did this dance? I think he'll look okay. Hurts when it rains, but otherwise damn Sweet of you to ask. Can't use the counter drug till I take out Tombstone's gang. Alright. I was gonna say, do I have to select the counter drug? What's going on here? The way he's talking about it. I need to clear out his men before I try the counter drug. You have your marketing department cook that name up? I am the marketing department. I missed whatever he said he called it. The audio got weird and far away. Ah no, the zombie guys. What the heck they're doing? Sounds like styrofoam or something when you punch him. He's really not that tough, all things considered. It's just if you're stupid and take a hit. He's not doing too much damage. I mean, that one cutscene made him seem invincible. Wouldn't want to take a break now, would you? Oh, Lonnie, tired? Someone's been skipping cardio. He's wearing down. I'm close. Yeah, that didn't do anything. <laughs> I don't know. If I gotta select this thing or what? No, there's nothing new there. I didn't think so. The way he was narrating it, like, come on, player, why are you being stupid? I need to use the serum or whatever. That is satisfying, though. Exploding a whole motorcycle on him. Take him down. The hell was that you do? Feel kind of. Oh, you know, articulated deep blocking agent. Oh. Man, my tongue feels funny. Is my tongue supposed to feel funny? Yeah, totally. 100% normal. I think. <laughs> this guy doesn't really seem bad. Someday, Lonnie, I want to find you doing good. Running a soup kitchen or something. Soon as soup pays, I'm in. 
End of the day, this is what I love. Great fight. Great challenge. You and I are very different people. Can we say your crazy drug lord days are done? Please? Sure. For now. Hell of a run, though. <laughs> Not quite how I'd describe it. Too much to hope you'll be taking it easier now that you're, uh, you know, mortal? <laughs> Not a chance. Threat of death just ups the thrill. Hell of a left hook. Can't wait for the rematch. I can. Hmm. <laughs> I like you. Huh. Yeah, he didn't seem like a bad guy at all. Kind of like mellowed out mid-fight. <laughs> yeah, well, we did it. Now the question is, what do we get for it? I'm not the guy in charge. Well, that was dramatic. I wonder how long Tombstone's powers will be negated for. Probably not long enough. Good work for now, though, Pete. Hats on the back all around. You ever seen a fire burn like that? Chem fire. Who knows what they had in this place? Jeez, thought it was just a bike. Anyway, they're just rambling some stuff. So, new suit. Spider armor, Mark Three. That's kind of crazy. I do like some of these suits. I'll start purchasing them soon, I think. But I think you get the suit power as well. Regardless, and you can wear whatever suit you want. You just get and use whatever power you want. You gotta unlock them first, though. Um, we have two skill points, but I'm saving up for three for that one good one. I don't know if we have time for this, but I'm gonna say yes. We haven't done a demon warehouse. It's nearby. Let's do it. I mean, it's probably perfectly fine to end the episode here, but we'll see what this is and hope that it's not too long of a thing. I mean, it is just going to be more brawling than the usual. But it's all good. It's just to see how it differs from the Fisk hideouts, at least. But yeah, I don't see myself recording every base fight, because it is pretty repetitive. Not sure about the research stations, either. We'll just have to see. So we'll do this real quick, and then next time we will move on with the main mission, whatever that what's in the box. Did he not? Uh oh. This is just a regular rooftop. Kind of crazy. He's still in danger. See that coming. Well, never mind, there's another one. So much for the opening act. Main events inside. 
All right, where's inside? Man, I really am not with Let's it. Dive right in. I went down to the bottom of the building. Didn't realize this thing was here the whole time. I guess that's what happens when you first wake up and don't really let yourself wake up and you just jump into recording. Oh. MJ, I'm at the first location on your list. And guess what I found? Demons? Give the lady a prize. See if you can figure out what they're up to while I introduce myself. You know what I'm talking about? Remember how I mentioned I have Watch Dogs 2 and the new one, Legion? Of the two, if any of you have played them. I feel like I would like Legion better, just because of the concept and where it takes place. But actually, my girlfriend said she thinks I should really play the second one. Not sure, though. Either way, Age of Calamity is my focus, like I said, for now. We'll see. I don't even know what's going to happen in 2021, to be honest with you. Still kind of battling with this health insurance need, as well as income. And there's a simple answer that solves both of those. At least the good news is, it seems like the world is slowly about to start getting better. You know, with all this vaccine stuff they're talking about. Which is still kind of sketchy, I don't know. Alright, wave two. So the difference here, it doesn't look like there's radar to see where everybody is. The Fisk ones had it, didn't they? Whatever, this is the fun part when they all come out, you just start doing all the bonus objectives and stuff. Ten finishers, ten swing clicks. Let's get on it. This really isn't bad at all. Remember when, like, the first encounter with the demons was actually kind of crazy with the swords and whatnot? Now with all these upgrades, just yank them in the air and pummel them to death. As long as you don't hang on every shelf possible. Alright. You know there's going to be rocket launcher guys at some point. Where the heck is everybody? I never was a fan of no radar in games. Like first person shooters, if there's no radar, I'm out. Golden Eye and Perfect Dark had radar by default, and it was an option to turn it off. And I became a master at studying that thing in conjunction with learning the maps, which I know is unrealistic. Just like you, who I wiped the floor with. Peter, that business is listed as an importer of computer parts. Huh. I didn't know they'd started making laptops out of guns. So it's an armory? Not for long. I'm about to get some payback for Jeff Davis. Everyone else that killed at City Hall. That City Hall cutscene was messed up. That's why I kind of really want to get More back to the main good. stuff, too. I meant to ask you, how do you deal with sneezing in your masks? Big problem for me. <laughs> I think we can all relate to that now, having to wear a mask all year. The worst is wearing glasses with a mask. It's the glasses I have, actually. The nose piece is so high up that I have to basically put the mask over my eyes as well to avoid fogging up the glasses. So this is 
try to wear contacts instead. Well, because of the insurance thing, I'm out of contacts. I'm like on a pair that was supposed to be thrown out two months ago, which is healthy. Hey, yes! Come in, grab a chair! We're playing charades! This is really racking up the video time. Oh well. Almost done. Might have waited too long to do these last couple finishers. Gotta have the focus for him too. Whip guy. Ground stuff doesn't build focus at all. There we go. Why is the prompt not there? I have the focus. The heck. It's seriously not letting me do a finisher on him. Well, we didn't get that bonus objective. Whatever. There are some weird things with this game. Again, I don't know if it's because I didn't update it, but... MJ, everything's quiet here now. You didn't get too carried away, did you? What they did was horrible, but... but you're not. Oh, you know, I... I there's nothing wrong with the game. I need two focus bars for those guys. Jeez, man. See you guys.